ASM was uh, introduced with Oracle 10G uh, a number of years ago, and basically ASM is a some sort of a, a volume manager for, for Oracle database, pretty much. The, the easy way to describe it is you, for on every system within your cluster, you give all the disks to Oracle. You do not have to partition disks. You do not have to create file systems on them. You do not have to create separate LUNs that are small for, for different data files. You don't have to worry about which database belongs to which LUNs and so forth. You just say, Here's a pool of storage, give it to the database uh, ASM instance, and then Oracle manages the storage. And there's many advantages for this, and, and primarily because we know the data. So first off, from a data placement point of view, if you create multiple databases within a single ASM storage environment, we, we basically stripe all the Oracle database uh, data across all the, all the volumes, so that we use the same uh, stripe and mirror everywhere uh, methodology. Secondly, when when a when there's a when there's a crash or or something similar like that, we know this, we know the data. So when we recover from a from a system failure and we have to do resilvering, we we read an Oracle block and we know that the block is correct or not. When you have a a volume manager underneath the database from any vendor, the vendor does not know what the data is on top. They have to assume that everything is invalid. Within the Oracle database, we know the data blocks are valid or not when we read the data. So this allows us to be a lot more intelligent on, on the recovery side. And from a, from a database administrator point of view, you just don't have to worry about data anymore. You type create database, the database gets created, and, and that's it. So it just makes life a lot more easy for, for any of the system administrators and database administrators. The relationship with Emulex is, is a very good one, and, and it's also a little bit different from a generic Oracle partner point of view. Traditionally, Oracle as a company dealt with the, the storage array vendors. We dealt with EMC and NetApp, and a lot of the benchmark and performance work was done with these few larger vendors, and they sort of took care of the relationship with either the, the network uh, vendors or the, the storage vendors like yourselves um, in the back end. However, when we start moving into the Linux space, where we do Linux OS development, we have a Linux OS support program, we actually have to have a relationship now with every vendor that we, that we support. So all the components in the stack that includes the storage adapter vendors, it includes the network card vendors, and so forth. And one interesting aspect is that, that Emulex has actually always stepped up to the plate saying, Oracle is important in our market because we're focused on the high-end storage. Oracle, obviously, with, it, with our product space, lives in that area as well. So a, a close partnership has always been very, very beneficial. Now, where this helps is one, as showed in the data integrity program, we actually do work very well together from a development point of view. We have a lot of uh, support relationships, we have development relationships, and from a customer point of view, that helps when they have a full stack, they get the software from us, we can work together on making sure that the storage adapters are okay, that the device drivers are the right ones, that the whole stack's been tested top to bottom. When there are support issues, we can work together as companies and partners, and there's no, there's no conflicts, it, it works just really well together.